two, three, funk it. My darling, I love you, 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 Fellow patriot, I love America. Why does it got the Puerto Rico flag on it? <laughs> That's what I was saying. <laughs> hey guys, so we got our room. This is my official 4th of July outfit. I'm wearing my high top Converse for comfort. This really pretty cream linen dress from Marshalls. My pouch is actually really special because I got it last year after 4th of July for when we were going to World Youth Day so that way with every outfit that I wore I already had like something that symbolized that I was American and then so I still have like tokens that I got from people. I got this little koala from someone that was Australian and then I'm wearing my little red decade bracelet from Mexico. I thought it was the perfect occasion. me of New York slash Chicago. Let me blow your mind. Okay. This predates that though. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, actually, I don't even know about this. I know like the city of Boston does, but I don't know about like the architecture. Gotcha. A day in the life as a Harvard student. Bella's mom makes some really good rainbow layer cookies. This just reminded me of her. Hi guys, so as you guys saw yesterday, we went to go tour Harvard. It kind of wasn't exactly what I was expecting, but it was really cool to get to see such a historic university. It was a quaint little town, a lot of brick. This is gonna sound really crazy, but the only way that I could associate it to something that I've seen before is it kind of reminded me of my high school campus. My high school campus was an old university that got turned into a high school. So it was really walkable and there was a lot of brick and a lot of the buildings were very historic. A lot of our buildings had columns on them too. Our principal and a lot of the teachers had to go around campus on little golf carts to put it into perspective. So I was just thinking of that, but it was really cool. I never imagined that I would actually see Harvard in person. It was never really on my bucket list. Once we decided to come to Boston to visit Benji, I knew we had to go see it. So the reason Benji wasn't with us yesterday is because he is staying at the Catholic Artists house here. He's spending some time here working on some projects and making connections with other Catholic artists. So he's staying over there and we'll get to see him more along the trip. He's going to give us a tour of where he's staying as well. So I will definitely show you guys that. Dun, 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 
doon, doon, doon. Central Park! <laughs> Playing the game here too <laughs> as we have dinner. And Jim's is full altar setup. This rooftop is giving Troy and Gabriella in high school musical three during Can I Have This Dance? This is so beautiful and such a special place. I'm so happy that Benji is here. How is it? How is it? How is it? Okay. <laughs> okay, sweet. Oh, yeah. 